Well, happening today, a big update right now expected from Governor Steve Sisolak on where Nevada stands right now in our fight against COVID-19. So the governor is expected to talk about cases, numbers, and also hospitalizations, but this is coming as several other states are starting to roll back on their mask mandates. So we do have Rachel Moore joining us here in studio with more on this. Rachel, good morning. Kalina Todd, good morning. Uh, right now, like you mentioned, several states, including California, have begun lifting their mask mandates, and this is because of the decline they're seeing in cases and hospitalizations. Here in Nevada, most counties still have high transmission rates, but numbers have been steadily declining. Now, right now, the current test positivity rate statewide is at 25.9%, and that's down from 32% since the beginning of February. In Clark County, both cases and hospitalizations are going down. Nationwide, the numbers have led the CDC to review its guidance. They have to be done at the local level, but I'm really encouraged The cases are continuing to drop dramatically. Hospitalizations are continuing to drop dramatically as um, people are making these decisions and as we are working on our guidance. Um, so I'm, I'm encouraged to, to see those trends. Now, even though the director of the CDC says that we're not quite there yet, White House officials have started consultations with state and local leaders, as well as public health officials. They're discussing steps to move into a post COVID-19 climate. The Southern Nevada Health District continues to urge people to protect themselves by uh, and others by getting vaccinated and a booster when eligible. They're also encouraging you to wear a mask when in public indoor places. And if you're sick, stay home and get tested. As for the governor's update, he's scheduled to speak at 10 o'clock this morning. 13 Action News will cover his speech and will bring you updates both on air and online. Live in studio, I'm Rachel Moore.